Hi everyone, Pastor Randy here. Now that Experience Jesus 2020 is over, what comes next? Well, I'm going to tell you, follow Jesus comes next. That's right. For those of you who went through the experience Easter week and uh, followed us each night getting to know Jesus a little bit better, now that that series has come to an end, you want to go further. You don't want the experience to end. It reminds me of those two disciples on the road to Emmaus who walked with the stranger for seven miles until they got to their home. It was Jesus, but they didn't know that. And when they got to their home, the stranger, Jesus, acted as if he was going to keep right on going and would have had they not invited him to stay and to come into their home and break bread with them. At their invitation, Jesus came, broke bread, and their eyes were opened, and they realized the stranger was Jesus, and it changed their lives. He was alive again. My friends, the series may be over, but don't let Jesus walk on by. I want you to invite him to come and to sup with you, to give you more training so that you, like his disciples, can sit at his feet and learn. That's what Follow Jesus is all about. It's a virtual classroom, uh, a set of Bible studies that we'll be going through on a Zoom-like platform, uh, but it's invitation only. Um, not everybody can do this. We're not going to live stream this. Uh, this is invitation only. So you've got to let us know that you want to follow Jesus now that you've experienced him. If you want to be part of this virtual classroom experience, I want you to um, send an email to info at rentonadventist.org. Got it? Info at rentonadventist.org. Give us your name, your desire to be a part of the class. The classes start next Tuesday, the 21st. So don't delay, okay? We need to fill up the spaces uh, for our students and get you information regarding curriculum, what we're going to be using. Every Tuesday evening at 7 p.m., follow Jesus Virtual Classroom. Please go there and sign up today. I look forward to seeing you sitting at the feet of Jesus.